A Tatiana Jefferson's family has been dealt another blow tonight. Her sister, Amber Carr, who spent the last three years fighting for justice in the case, is now fighting for her own life. Yeah, we've learned that Carr has congestive heart failure, and this week, doctors gave her family some devastating news. Here's Adriana de Alba. Inside this hospital room, it's a late Christmas celebration for Atatiana Jefferson's family. Her sister, Amber Carr, was hospitalized during Aaron Dean's murder trial. They are experiencing this in real time. Two weeks since Dean's sentencing, family attorney Lee Merritt says Amber is still in the hospital fighting for her life. She's the mother of Zion Carr, Atatiana's 11-year-old nephew who was inside the home when Dean shot and killed his aunt Atatiana. The families who have endured this kind of injustice, they spend so much time fighting for justice, they don't get a proper time to grieve and to heal. Merritt says Amber has congestive heart failure and is ineligible for a heart transplant. And a doctor has told her that she will not live through the weekend. It's a brutal reality for Amber, who spent three years seeking justice for her sister. The hardest part about all of this is for me uh, and for the family is dealing with the children. Uh, who are gro literally growing up experiencing trauma after trauma. So Zion was eight years old when he watched his auntie shot to death in front of him. He's now playing with his mother in her hospital bedroom. Just when the end of the trial brought the family some relief, their healing journey faces yet another fight. In DFW, I'm Adriana D'Alba.